What's going on everyone? Welcome to the channel. I'd like to take a quick minute and ask you guys for your support of the channel. Not with money, but by simply clicking the like button below the playhead and also leaving a comment down below. Believe it or not, that helps out the channel tremendously. Also, if you get through the whole video and you enjoy it, consider hitting the subscribe button. Alright, with that out of the way, let's jump into the video. Package just came from Amazon and we're gonna go out and grab this package. I'm gonna unbox it. We're gonna take a look. Alright, so is there a better way to carry your range ammo to the range? I think I found the perfect solution, at least for me. And if you guys like it, I encourage you guys to do the same. But like everybody else, when you first start shooting, you just you take your ammo boxes, you put them in your range bag, and you go to the range. That's kind of a, a, a pain because those are bulky, the cardboard boxes. Sometimes they rip open and spill all over the place. It's just not an ideal way to carry your ammo. Then what do you do after that? You usually go out and you buy one of these plastic ammo containers like I got back here. And again, if you're going to shoot multiple calipers, you got to carry two, three of these with you, which that becomes a real pain. You got to carry these, you got to carry your range bag. It, it becomes a nightmare, especially if you're by yourself. You know, you're going to be lugging all this gear. So what I found is these Nalgene water bottle uh, ballistic bags, which are great. Originally, I wanted the G-Code ones, but they're just too much damn money. The G-Code ones, after you buy the patch for it and everything, they're like 40 bucks. So you now if you're shooting multiple calibers, do the math. That can get quite expensive. So the ones I found were two for 20 bucks. I'll link it down in the description down below. Basically, this is what it is, guys. Like I said, it's a Nalgene ballistic water bottle holder. And uh, we're going to hop down on the bench and take a look at this. All right, so I already opened up the other ones. These come two for $20, $19.99. You get two of the ballistic water bottle pouches, and you also get two American flag morale patches. So it comes in the Ziploc bag. Let's open it up. The brand of this is Amayapo. Of course, they're out of China. Everything else is made in China. You get their business card with it. They want your support and uh, go on YouTube and follow them. You get your American flag morale patch, which is nice. These are typically five bucks a piece. So there's $10 right there. So two of these bags plus the patches for 20 bucks, $19.99 free shipping, I think is a home run. Then we're gonna take the bag out. We'll go over that real quick and then we'll go over the one that I already have outfitted. All right, so this bag is made of a ballistic nylon material. I don't know the, the ballistic denier on this, but it seems to be pretty thick. I'd say it's probably a thousand. 800 to 1,000. I've had enough bags to know my, my material. All hook and loop on the front with the shock cord. You got two plastic D-rings on each side for your, for your strap, which I did order a strap for this. So you can carry this on your shoulder and that's one less thing you gotta carry. Or you can molly this to your range bag. There's two, two snaps on the back. Now my GPS tactical bag that I have for the range, I have a video on here if you guys wanna go back and look at it. It's all hook and loop. I mean, uh, I'm sorry, it's all molly on there. So I can molly this to my range bag if I wanted to or put it inside the range bag. Or if you have molly inside your vehicle, be behind your truck seat or whatever, you can molly this to anything. And then what I also like is these two D-rings on the side, you can daisy chain them together. So if you want to carry two or three of them, there's plastic D-rings, you hook them together and then put your strap on the outer side of it and carry it. So I think it's a, it's, it's pr it's a pretty good setup. I think this solves a big problem with carrying ammo to the range. Zippers aren't YKK, but they're very good zippers. Inside of it, you got a lot of space in here because this is designed for a 32 ounce Nalgene bottle. But this will hold about a thousand rounds of nine millimeter, probably thousand rounds of 45. I don't know how much 223, I haven't filled it up yet, but we're gonna put some 556 in there and see what that holds, also 22. But again, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna fill these. These are going to be designed for, for range day. To go to the range with maybe two to 400 rounds and then have a place to put your empties because I reload and put them in here. But let's go over the one I have outfitted out. All right, so this is the one that I have already all outfitted out. Originally, like I said, I wanted G-Code. They're just too expensive. The only thing I did like on the G-Code over these is the top of the G-Code had the hook and loop. So you can put your, your patch on top to tell you what caliber is in the bag. I did order those from G-Code. They're just not here yet but they're gonna have to go on the front with this, where this hook and loop is. It's not a deal breaker. You're just gonna have to look on the front of your bag to see what caliber you got if you're carrying multiple bags with different calibers. But I think this is a great solution. 
So let's open this up, see what I got in this one. Got the Uplula in here, always carrying Uplula, especially with nine millimeter, because it gets a little cumbersome when you start loading those in, they get really hard at the end. 45 is not a problem. And inside here is about 400 rounds of Freedom Seeds that I made. These are my, these are my home brew. But again, typically I'll go to the range with anywhere from 250 to 500, which is gonna leave me about half of this pouch empty to either put an Uplula in or extra mags in. It's not a waste of space. You can put extra mags on top to take up the dead space. So if you're taking four boxes, 200 rounds, you got plenty of room to, to throw two or three magazines in there easily. And at the end of the day, you got, you got a spot to put all your empty brass in. I just think this is a great way to carry your ammunition to the range versus carrying those big bulky plastic ammo containers. I hate carrying those. All right, guys, so hopefully you guys got a good look at this. Make your decision if you think this is the way for you to go. I think for me, going forward, this is absolutely the way. Because like I said, you take these two D-rings, you daisy chain these two together, and then you hook your strap on this side and this side, and you can carry two of them, three of them at once. It's the way to go. All right, guys, we're gonna hop out for some final thoughts. Okay, so some quick closing thoughts. I think this bag right here is the perfect solution to carrying your range ammo to the range, at least for me. Hopefully you guys got a little bit out of the video and can agree with me on this. This is a great way to carry them. All right, guys, you got any questions or comments, leave them down below. Be sure to hit a like and subscribe, like I said, on the channel. And we'll see you guys in the next one.